we got here? The precious. The precious. <laughs> There's definitely something wrong with him. Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how we're going to fit the windows to the camper van. So we're going to basically put a fixed window in this side and in the opposite panel, we're going to put a window with a sliding insert. So let's get to it. We need to cut out a hole in the panel bigger than this internal piece. But that gives us plenty of room to leave lots of metal all around the van. So if we have a look at the other side of it, so we've got this side here. All we basically do is cut a hole bigger than this in the side panel of the van and then apply some adhesive, stick the window to the adhesive, tape it up from the top to stop it sliding down until it sets. The adhesive that comes with it is one hour adhesive. So basically, by the time I apply the adhesive and stick the glass on in one hour's time, it'll be good and ready to go. So let's have a look at some of the options of cutting our holes in the window. From inside the van, we can see we've got a skin here and all the way around. So the simplest way of doing this is making a hole here, here, here and here with a hole saw and then cutting along this line, cutting across this panel, taking the panel out and then we're ready to go. Okay, so I'm going to put a cut a template out of this cardboard box. Okay, so hi there everyone. We're going to cut out the template now and we're going to use that template to cut out the hole in the side of the door and now is to fit the window for the camper van. So, so anything, as long as it's bigger than this, that we cut out of that, will give us our perfect entry. So let's go inside the camper van and have a look, see, when we offer the template up to the aperture in the wall, or to the hole in the door, what we end up with. So that's perfect. So let's mark it. And make sure that we have the hole cut for the right size and everything will be just perfect. Okay, so looking at a selection of tools that we have, uh, we can use an angle grinder, perfectly for cutting metal, using a skinny disc, so it means that we're not using, removing too much metal and it doesn't take a lot of time to take it away. We can use a reciprocating saw, which is the, another saw that you can use to cut metal. Um, what I'm actually going to use on this one, it's the metal shears. So it actually will cut along and cut a really nice strip all the way around. I'm going to join the hole saw dots and then I might just need to touch them up. Uh, I'm going to go and get a hole saw, a drill, and drill some holes in the van. That hole saw. Shit. Right. So, let's drill a hole and see what happens. Okay. There's a hole. There's an air body saw. Let's pop it in here.
Okay, so now for the next step, basically we need to put an activator around the frame. That allows the adhesive that we put on the glass to bond it to the metal straight away, really, really tight and really, really strong. When we bond the window, I'm gonna put a couple of strips of duct tape just hanging from the top so it's a non-stretch tape and it just stops gravity in the way of the window just moving down on where we bond it so it just holds it there we leave it there for an hour and then it's good to go so let's go over and have a look at the window so we put a glass primer white all around the window we put a bead of our bonded glass adhesive around here and then we stick the window to the frame and we're good to go so I'm going to use some of this which is the body primer to seal the cut edges of where I've used it and then I'm also going to use it to paint the side of the glass The next trick is to get a couple of pieces of masking tape up here. Get a couple of pieces of duct tape there and just have them ready to drop down hold the windscreen I hold the glass in place so that it doesn't slide now we have a window of opportunity here that we're going to take full advantage of and you're going to lift the glass up and put it in place Climb up here, climb up there, and squish it against the window. Now, how are we looking? Almost perfection. So, I pull this tape down nice and quickly. And this guy looks good. He's good. He's in tight. Onto the glass. Fixed panel, sliding window, sliding door, fixed window. That's basically going to allow us to have the access to the window. So the window's over here on the bench. So I've got to open at the minute. It's a bit hard to see because of the shadows. Apologies. But that's basically the window. What I did on the last one was I used the air saw. On this one, because the panel is quite easy to cut out, I'm gonna use the air shears. I need to drill a couple of holes to allow me to get the pin of the shears in, and then I'm gonna run it along. So I'm gonna set up the cameras now and show you how to cut this panel out 
with the shears it gives a lovely nice straight cut <laughs> So we have the window now installed, it's got the tape on it, leave it on it for an hour and then hopefully I'll leave it on for a couple of hours and then we'll pop the tape off and we'll be able to check the windows. I think it's all turned out absolutely fantastic.